Over the next few months, the department will be implementing a new dashboard and task management interface into many of the grant reporting functions. This video will be a short overview of the task management function. If you haven't seen it yet, be sure to check out the video on the dashboard functionality. The task management system identifies, initiates, and closes the common set of tasks that are used on a regular basis. To begin, log into SAFE and select your program. Now, you may be associated with more than one organization or role. If so, you'll need to supply that information before your dashboard appears. The dashboard displays a number of widgets, each of which has its own business function. Among your widgets is the task manager. In this example, there are three tasks, one assigned to the user and two assigned to the group. Clicking the associated button reveals a general description of the tasks. Here we see that all the tasks are related to school improvement diagnostic review. And then clicking on the count takes you to the full list. If you have a long list of tasks, you could narrow it by filtering the results. Search by IRN if you're looking for a particular organization, or you can filter the list by specifying a category, a status, or a priority. You can toggle among the task lists here. Here in the My Tasks tab, we see everything assigned to the user. To see the specifics of the task, click Proceed. In this case, and this is not real data or tasks, just a fictional example, we see that the user task is to submit a corrective action plan. Correspondingly, we're in the Issues Corrective Action Plans tab up here. The current status and the next available action are noted, and help text is offered over here. Also, there's a link to the appropriate user manual down here. To take the required task action, click here. In this case, the system is letting me know that another step is required before it can be considered submitted. That's a really great feature of the new task management system. It details which of your tasks are pending, offers you a path to and an explanation of what needs to be done, and provides explanations and technical information that are relative to your task. To return, click the Back to Task Management link. Clicking the Group Tasks tab shows pending tasks assigned to your group. You can click to access and complete the tasks in the Group Task list, and by selecting a task and clicking Assign Selected Task to Me, you move the task from the group task list and place it into your list. And there it is. Remember, in all the task list tabs, you'll see a link to the user manual and forms, and you can perform a number of helpful searches with this pull down. To return to your dashboard, click Dashboard. And that, in a nutshell, is how the new task management system works. There's an accompanying video on use of the dashboard, and you can access that by clicking this arrow button in the upper right-hand side of your dashboard.